to 123 MyP's video on how to use the Windows 10 media creation tool. Okay guys, so uh, in the future I want to try and do some videos on how to install Windows 10 on a MacBook Pro uh, 2015. And to do that, what we'll actually need is a Windows 10 ISO file or it can be Windows 8 ISO file. So what I'm going to do is show you now how you can actually get a copy of Windows 10 or Windows 8 using the media creation tool. Okay, and uh, so, okay, so I can hear you say, what's the catch? To install this version of Windows 10 or Windows 8.1, you will actually need a product key. So if you have a product key, maybe from a, a previous version, uh, maybe a DVD that you have purchased in store, um, you can use uh, that product key with Windows 10 that you download needs to be the same as the product key. So if you have a product key for Windows 10 Home Edition, then you need the uh, Windows 10 Home Edition uh, ISO file. Okay, so if you don't have a product key and you're looking to purchase uh, Windows 10, you can go to the 123MyIT website, click on Store, and you can go through by just clicking any of the links here, you can go through and purchase uh, those copies of Windows. All right, uh, so let's let's go and download the Windows uh, Media Creation Tool. So to get that, you'll need to go to the 123MyIT website, uh, click on Downloads at the top, scroll down to about uh, where it says uh, Create Installation Media for Windows 8.1. Okay, what we want to do is we have the Create Media Tool here, or you've got these links below it, Windows 10 Insider Preview. Okay, this, this version is no longer available for ISO, but what we're going to do is we're going to use this link here. Okay, if you're running a uh, Windows 32-bit uh, version, use this tool. If you want Windows 8, use this tool here. Okay, um, however, we're using a 64-bit uh, uh, copy of Windows uh, 8, and we want to use the create media tool so we would click on this one here all right we would save it and i would save as and i've already gone ahead and downloaded it and that's this tool here on the desktop okay, so we want to run the windows uh, 10 media creation tool now you can upgrade this pc now we don't want to do that we want to put a dot in the create installation media for another pc and hit next. Now guys, I get a lot of questions about people asking me, can I use this for a new PC and not a Mac? Sure you can. You can use this as a, a um, fully fledged copy of Windows that you can use. Okay, so we want to select our language. So there's loads of languages to go through. I'm going to select uh, English United States. Uh, the edition will be Windows 10 Home, Windows Home N, uh, Windows Home Single Language, Windows 10 Pro, Windows Pro N. Okay. I'm going to select Windows 10 Home. Now you can choose which architecture you want to download it for. Um, I've got a Windows 64-bit um, version, and you can tell that by going and uh, right-clicking on your Start Bar if you're in Windows uh, 8. <coughs> Go to System. All right, and there you will see it says System Type 64-bit. Okay, so we're going to run a 64-bit. Most uh, most platforms or most hardware uses 64-bit uh, these days, so you can be pretty safe if you're going to choose 64-bit and download that. You're going to be pretty safe to get that file. Now you can copy it directly to a USB drive. So if you wanted to install Windows from a USB drive, you could do that version, or you could press on the ISO version, and this is what we're going to use in the Windows uh, installing Windows on on a Mac. Uh, videos at a later stage, so we want to hit next. All right, it's going to ask us where do we want to save the file. We would just select desktop. You can see that's where I've already downloaded and saved a previous version. So I'm just going to go, go save there. All right, and then that will go ahead and it will save a copy of Windows 10 to your desktop. I'm just going to close that now. Have this uh, file here. This file, if you open it up, see you've got the setup files here which you can run we'll go ahead and uh, install Windows 
Okay guys, so that's pretty much it. This is just a really simple, uh, quick video today um, so that uh, I don't have to uh, take up time in the, w the other uh, videos. And uh, this will show you how to get a copy of Windows 10, Windows 8.1 um, ISO files. Uh, and just remember that you will need a product key to, uh, to, to install the, the, um, this software. Okay guys, so I hope that's helpful. If that's helpful, please leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to share it with your friends. And thanks for watching. Bye-bye.